When you think of Muslim women, you probably don't think high fashion and style. But a growing Islamic fashion industry is taking over runways and the blogosphere, with Muslim fashionistas putting modern twists on modesty and using hijab fashion as a tool for self-expression. I graduated in 2004 with my master's in broadcast journalism and thought I was going to go into television. And what happened was along the way, a lot of people basically told me wearing a hijab you're not going to get in, um, news directors and such. So instead of being disheartened, I decided I would take my talents elsewhere. And I went ahead and started this blog where I felt like I could have uh, an outlet for Muslim women like myself who grew up reading Seventeen and Cosmo and we never felt like we exactly fit in. Do you guys feel that by embracing fashion and by using it as self-expression, it is in fact empowering? Absolutely. I, I think it empowers you in many fronts, one of which is it allows you to engage in a dialogue with people that is not so didactic. Um, by that I mean walking down the street and wearing a very fashionable look, but maybe wearing a Chanel jacket or um, a, a, a dress or pant by another top designer, but styling it and wearing it with your hijab, people, you'll get compliments and they'll say, oh, and you know, why are you wearing that on your head? Because they're not, um, people are not matching style with Muslims. And then you say, well, I'm Muslim. And then there's a, really, I've never seen someone dress like you. And then you have a dialogue, whereas that, that didn't exist, that may not have existed before in that space, where people thought that you were gonna to try to convert them, which I certainly do not, <laughs> um, or um, engage in polemics, which the, the average everyday person doesn't want to be angry, they wanna enjoy life. And Absolutely. fashion certainly allows you to do so.